Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I got something a little bit different for you. Uh, it's something that you should uh, do at least once or twice a year and uh, that's to change cabin filters in your vehicle so you get proper airflow through your heating uh, and ventilation ducts uh, for the winter and for your air conditioning in the summer and again yet your heat in the winter. So I'm going to show you really quick on how to change um, these filters in uh, in my wife's work van that she uses for work and uh, I'll be right back and we'll get this thing going here uh, so hang tough I'll be right back so I use these uh, Napa premium cabin filters and the best thing to do is to get your owner's manual to find out where your cabin where your cabin filter is but in this van it happens to be in the glove box and in behind this little plate here right in here is the cabin filter I'll kind of get set up and uh, pull these out and uh, show you how to change them so I'll be right back um, it's gonna be hard to do this one-handed so back again this little door just pops open in the van here if I can get this one handed over here and the filter is right in here so I will get the camera kind of turned around here and I'll pull these filters out there's actually two of them in here we'll go back this way gotta get in here And they just slide out like so okay so look at now again in my defense we just picked up this van again you can see we have one over here that's the summer van and this van here and we have a spare one back here so we do have a fair amount of these vans and like I said we just picked this up so this filter being this dirty Will be the cause why the air doesn't blow through the vents so i've got this one out and we'll reach in here clean this out there's a fair amount of garbage in here leaves Let me just go back in here again kind of hard to do with one hand you got to get in here and you slide the other one slide the other one like so there we go we can pull this one out too and we'll just see hey so it's a good idea if your uh, if your vehicle's not blowing any um, hot air or very very not very powerful through the vents, then you've got a problem. Like I said, with your uh, with your filters. So it's good to check these again. Like I said, in in my defense, we just picked this van up last week, and I've been going through it to do some stuff, and. Uh, eh? And I knew I was going to have to replace these filters. A lot of people don't even know that they're there. So that's all cleaned out. Our new filters are in the box here. We'll get them out. So, like so. And again they go there's a direction on them and if you don't remember you just you know just remember how they came out so you can go back in here now and you just push that one in like so and just push it over to the side there's a little bit of a spring tension on there and you get the second one and 
and there you go. Shove it in. Get this, uh, get this door locked. There we go. And then you can just put the, this cover back on. I gotta clean up this here anyway a little bit. So, there you go. There's the um, fast and simple way of changing those cabin filters. Uh, again, it's winter time and I know you're going to want heat in your van and you're going to want it to blow good. So, uh, double check. Look in your owner's manual. Check online. Find out where those cabin filters are and replace them. You'll thank me later for replacing those filters because you'll have way better airflow through your heating and, and heating vents and again in the summertime so like I said this van was brand new to us last week and I'm just going through it to checking checking some of the stuff and I wanted to check those cabin filters I do them in the fall and I do them in the spring and if need be if they're on dusty roads I check them halfway through the summer so again thanks for watching hope you like this little bit of an instructional video on cabin filters and we'll talk to you guys soon like, share, and please subscribe. It'll help the channel grow, and we'll talk to you guys later. Thanks. Bye.